can't even believe this is really happening. Like, it don't even feel real. Like, I'm about to be somebody's mother. Somebody about to be calling me ma. and I'm back with another video and today's video as y'all can see by the title you already know I'm spilling my beans bitch I'm finally letting the cat out the bag I've been hiding this for damn near seven months and it's finally time to give y'all the tea so yeah if y'all want to hear about me and my lord if y'all want to hear about this this whole situation that I'm in make sure y'all stay tuned because this is crazy y'all I can't even believe this is really happening. Like, it don't even feel real. Only time it really hit me is when I'm at an appointment or I'm getting like a sonogram or ultrasound. Then, like, it really hits me. Like, or if I like feel the baby move or I feel kicks, then it'll hit me. Like, it's really a human in here and it really gotta come out one day. Like, oh my God. And then I get scared. But y'all, I'm trying to just not even think too hard about it. I be asking all my peoples I know who got kids. I ask my mother, my friend mother. And they all say like, it don't really hurt. As long as you get the epidural, really it's the contractions that hurt. But everybody make it seem like it don't hurt. And I'm not gonna lie, when I got my BBL, y'all, that shit was painful. Like, it, it, it was painful. I'm not gonna say it was the worst pain, but it was. I had to deal with some pain. So I feel like if I could deal with that pain, I could deal with some pain so i feel like i'd be all right like i done been through some pain i don't know what to really expect it don't matter how many times they explain it to me or like describe it or whatever i still don't really know like because you know everybody different but y'all i'm happy i'm so happy i'm just like <laughs> this is really happening like i'm about to be somebody mother somebody about to be calling me ma like it's crazy y'all yeah it's true. The caption, I meant the um, title of this video, it's true. It's not a vlog, it's not a prank. It's true, like it's really happening. Your girl really got a bun in the oven and it's gonna be here November 22nd. That's my due date, y'all. So, y'all, I'm definitely gonna be posting my whole journey. Y'all know I bring y'all and tell y'all everything. I bring y'all along with me in my life because that's why I made this channel. So, yeah, y'all know y'all gonna be Y'all gonna be caught up on everything that's going on. So, y'all, right now, I'm, I got this little baby app center, baby center app on my phone, and it say I'm 28 weeks and five days. So I'm almost 29 weeks. So that's seven months. I'm in my third trimester, y'all. And honestly, I could say like, it ain't been bad for me. Of course, at first, like, the first couple months, I did throw up a little bit. A couple times I threw up. I like would brush my teeth and like, you know, throw up a little bit. But that was it. Oh, and my boobs, like around my nipple and my areola, like the brown part around my nipple, it like, it get real dry and itchy. And like, it look, it feel like it's peeling. But I start putting like this little oil on there. Out of the, I'm gonna put a picture of the little thing that I got from Walmart. But I used the oil that came inside this little kit right here. And I just put it on there. Every time I got out the shower. And it helped. Like, it helped my, um, helped it stop peeling and stuff. But I stopped using it. So now I was doing it again. So I had to start back using it. But yeah, I used to, like, do it heavy. Put it, like, on my stomach, on my nipples and stuff. But I'm going to get back on my stuff. Because I'm not trying to have no ugly scratch marks. And I'm not trying to have no dry, itchy-ass boobs. But, y'all, that's the only thing that... I really like like a symptom that I have also I'm not gonna lie I be having like kind of like mood swings not really mood swings but I'm easily easily irritated now even though I already was but it's worse and then like sometimes my ankles hurt sometimes I don't know if it's from work because like where I when I be at work the air the AC blow directly on my legs like it's right there behind my legs so I don't know if it's from that cold air blowing on me or what but my ankles do be hurting a little bit and my legs be hurting a little bit too my back was hurting real bad but it stopped but other than that y'all 
I don't really have no like symptoms like this. It feels normal, but y'all know what they say, like as you get to closer to the end, it gets worse or whatever. But everybody is different, so I don't know. Y'all gonna see, cause I'm gonna be keeping y'all updated. But as of now, y'all, everything cool. You know, everything cool. I just be real thirsty too. Like I be thirsty a lot, I be drinking a lot of water. I go to the bathroom like every 10, 15, 20 minutes, literally. But anyway, y'all. Yeah, that's the only thing that I've really been feeling. But well, that's the only difference I really feel. But I can't believe I kept this from y'all this long. Some people probably already put two and two together. Some probably didn't. I've been really keeping, I've been really doing good. Like, one thing about me, I can keep the secret, especially when it comes to mine. I can keep my secrets. I can keep anybody's secrets, but to, I know how to shut the fuck up. So, I really did a good job keeping this in. But it's finally time to let y'all know. I'm um I, I'm gonna post my pictures at the same time I post this video or my first pictures because I took some maternity pictures and they look so good. Speaking of maternity pictures, I'm gonna have my vlog of my um photo shoot. I'm gonna have like behind the scenes getting ready and everything in that vlog that's gonna be posted after this video. Y'all make sure y'all hit that bell so y'all don't miss none of my new uploads that I got coming because I'm ready to have them coming back to back to back to back for y'all. The vlog of my um, behind the scenes of my maternity shoot vlog that's coming to you right after this one so make sure you go watch it if it's posted by now by the time you see this video if not it'll be up soon pool so just be on the lookout and yeah make sure y'all go like the pictures on my Instagram if y'all don't follow me already make sure y'all go follow your girl at Lanela now period I'm trying to just talk some more so I can have at least 10 minutes for this video because I need 10 minutes but y'all I cannot believe I'm about to be 29 weeks like do y'all wanna I'm about to show y'all my stomach so y'all can see like look at this and then I'm so tiny like I'm so tiny y'all do y'all see <laughs> y'all I was so tiny. I think, I really think I'm so tiny like that is because I just got a BBL literally and then I came home and got knocked up like a dummy. So I think that's what it is. But I don't know. Everybody keeps saying I'm gonna blow up at like my eighth, like when I get to like eight and a half months or whatever. Everybody keeps saying I'm gonna blow up because I've been little this whole time, y'all. Because I really just start getting a bump at seven months like i had to really eat before my maternity sh pictures i had to eat and drink a lot of water just so i could look you know a little bit bloated because i had to hurry up and take my pictures because like i'm damn i'm fucking seven months and i didn't want to just not take pictures and post them and tell y'all but i'm having my gender reveal next week so i had to like you know take the pictures and then let it let everybody know and then send the invites out and I couldn't wait too late and I already planned for the reveal to be next week and I don't want to keep waiting too late because I'm seven months and I still need time to you know get stuff in order get stuff together for my child so it's like I need to know so yeah y'all I feel um, anxious. I just feel like I just want to meet it, he or she. I want to meet the baby already. I just want to hold it and love on it already. I cannot wait until November 22nd, y'all. I just can't. I just want. I just can't ex wait to experience like how everything is going to be. Like I don't know, y'all. I'm just so like, I don't know. But y'all, pray for me. Wish me the best because a bitch is scared. A bitch is scared. A bitch already know I'm going to be crying because I'm going to cry, baby. If y'all watch my BBL vlog, y'all heard me crying like a big ass baby. So, yeah, y'all. 
I need, I should have went in the car and got my sonogram so I could do a thumbnail. What I'm doing? I don't even have it. Maybe I could just take a picture of it and put it on the screen. What y'all think? Or maybe I could like just get the picture in my phone and like hold it up and just be like, <laughs> yeah, I would do that. Cause I don't feel like going. I do. It's, I don't feel like going outside to the car. Then I had to park down the street. No. <laughs> I hope I got a good one. If anybody else is pregnant right now, comment down below your due dates or whatever. I'm having me a Scorpio baby. I don't really like Scorpios, but I'm gonna love my child. But yeah, y'all, my due date is November 22nd. Make sure y'all be on the lookout. I hope the baby come before then. I'm not gonna lie because Thanksgiving is like two days after that and I need to be like healed and home and like ready to enjoy my meal because I be waiting for Thanksgiving to come around. So yeah, you need to come before that. But anyway, y'all, I'ma definitely make sure I bring y'all along on this journey with me. I'm so happy to finally be telling y'all I know y'all didn't see this coming, but yeah, this is what's going on. So yeah, y'all, I'm happy. I hope y'all happy for me. And that's the end of this video for real. I just wanted to let y'all know because I didn't want to just come out the blue and post pitch, post pictures with a stomach and y'all be like, when the fuck this happened? So I had to let y'all know. So this video was just to let y'all know what's going on. So yeah, comment if you surprised or you didn't see this coming or whatever. Just comment something down below, y'all. But if y'all made it this far in this video, I want to say thank you so much for watching. I love y'all so much. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all my social medias. That's Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Twitter, all that. At Lene I'm going to link it down below to make it easier for you. Y'all already know the drill. And yeah, on that note, I'm going. Bye, y'all.